The Kookaburra overpass will run from the existing airport roundabout to a new roundabout that will be created at the junction of John Guy's Drive and Magani Crescent. Some markers placed by NCDC surveyors are so close to some residential homes just beyond Kookaburra Street. Hiowa Hape and his family own the land they are settled on. Though he welcomes the government's plans, he is worried he may be asked to move. I'm awesome. I'm good plus I'm me. Some change of city, image plus city, believe me at the same time. Uh, motorists, side blow motorists, or traffic number, no I'm good plus. That's all. Los side blow me plus, I'm at least almost finding some blood space or no what, or give some little coin to me plus. Especially me plus, one style of block or some title holders. I'm a good plus, I'm also supposed to only my stock survey or come also and work a year plus by move, so me plus by ready. An overpass is a road structure that will be built on cement pillars. Though it will run overhead, a lot of land will be cleared to accommodate the infrastructure. The settlement here is located on the back road leading to the arts theatre. Many families here have lived for more than three decades, but they've been given notice to evacuate. Alex Capesia is a community leader. He understands why they are being asked to move but is concerned where the 3,000 plus people will be moved to. And by Gaman and by putting Mr. Gupla development in coming set, and Mibla Papon Guinea by Grosso, Mibla by known of Tognogat, Silla Kain Samtin, and coming set, Mibla Hamasta Sol, and Tokushin, me to finish, and we can come now by talking me plows and okay, me give me plumble location, lohab, and Mibla is it a solver, and blame me for Golosla. The people from the art settlement have been evacuated to accommodate the overpass. Some have moved to this settlement, however, not for long. The government says the overpass will be a masterpiece construction by New Zealand company Hawkins PNG Limited. It will improve traffic flow.